Hey guys, this is Marga Hampshire Wanderer here, and this is the very first official video on the Hampshire Wanderer channel. I'm a little nervous as to how this will work out. As I'm learning how to work everything through on the channel here, I decided I'll go back to school here and start with School Tycoon. Okay, so that's all the introduction done, so let's get started just on the sandbox level. Here we've got three different types of school you can do. They have different challenges there. Mainly, the students look for different things on each level in each school there, and also there are different events which happen, which cause damage to the to the buildings and everything. So what I'll do is I'll start off with the farmlands here. Okay, so here we go. We're at the farmland school at the moment. As you can see, there's absolutely nothing built. Because there's nothing here, there's no five-star ratings, there's no percentage scores, and the grades are all at F. Well, what do you expect with absolutely nothing? So let's get a change. I mean, it's Going a load of little hints and tips at the bottom here, so it's saying build a classroom, to get students in, to get money in, to build more, so blah 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 blah. So let's get us started. Okay, so we've got all the classrooms here under the academics, so we've got English, Social Studies, Geography, Maths, Library, blah blah blah, whatever. You'll see here that the later ones aren't actually open yet, we can't. We can't actually build those yet. We have to build all these ones first. So let's start with an English one. It's not a brilliant one there, but it's something to start off with. Okay, when it's green, you can place it. If it's orange, you can't. It's pretty easy to figure out. Okay, so that's that one done. Okay, there's still no students there. That's because we haven't got any teachers. So let's hire one of them. N absolutely no fun whatsoever. S quite high strictness and... Meh, okay, skill. Sounds a bit like the stuff I had at... Sounds a bit like the teachers I had at, at school when I was there. What I'll do is, to begin with, I'll hire all the cheapest ones I can. They may not be brilliant, but, well, it'll just... Okay, okay, I'll put you down. Okay, they may not be the brilliant teachers, they may not be the best ones, but they're cheap. And they can help us earn money. Here we can see there's immediately ten students started. Just for one, like, just for one lesson. Ah, well. And here we can see that as we've put in a class and absolutely no fitness stuff. The athletics has gone up to a grade C. Academics is still an F. Discipline, yeah. Morale, yeah. Facilities are A that will go down the more the facilities are used. So let's make sure that we have some way of maintaining them. So if we go on to the administration ones there. The janitor's office, that will keep everything clean, as clean as it can. Okay, we put that there. And now we can hire, well, let's just hire one janitor at the moment. Okay, he's down. We also need a way to keep the buildings up and running so they don't fall apart, which does make a major improvement on the school I went to. So let's build a uh, maintenance shed, or whatever it's called. Here we go. And now we can hire Trevor from. No, we're not Trevor, was it? Ah, uh, you know which one I mean, that guy from Grand Theft Auto. Here we 
Here we've got all the students coming in. Yeah, well, we could tell that already. Let's see what this one thinks. Casey Davis have absolutely no idea who that is, but ah well. Hmm. Uh, okay with athletics. Bit clumsy. Bit like me, really. Okay, so we've still got about five thousand dollars there. We could do with a little bit more income coming in. We get money per student. So let's build another classroom. Let's go for the very next one there, which is maths. Let's put that there. And another classroom means another teacher. Yeah, that one will do. Yep, so we now have 15 students there. Let's see what... Hmm, they want different classes there. Someone wants art, someone wants chemistry or something. We'll get that done later on. As you can see, everyone's just... having a point there. You can't really see where I'm pointing to with my finger, so I'll show you here. Everyone was walking around there. Let's make things a little easier. And... I say make things a little easier. That's better. Put in a yeah, put in a bit of extra pathways there, so they can just walk straight through. Okay, I'm pretty sure they'll be there sitting, sitting or standing there with the legs crossed at the moment. So let's sort that all out. For the number of students we have in, that'll do. And here we can see at the bottom we've unlocked a uh, nurse's office. We've also unlocked a detention centre as well. So let's build that. We need a detention teacher now, so let's hire one of them. Excuse me, sorry. Uh, you might be able to tell I've got a bit of a cough on at the moment. Yeah, that one will do. So, now, that really did sound like one of my old teachers there. Yeah. Okay, there's a newspaper that started here. Students' athletics has risen, despite the fact there's absolutely nothing built to help with that, but. Well, that's just how the game starts. Student academics rise, fair enough. Student morale rises, fair enough. That'll go down soon enough. Okay, let's carry on. So, let's build more of a path. Yep, that's that. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's I uh, want something to eat soon. So, let's just put in a couple of vending machines. Yep, so there's that one, and a drinks machine, which goes, yeah, that'll do, uh, maybe not. There we go, now that'll do. Unfortunately, that's removed a couple of, a couple of little paving slabs there, so let's put those back in, and you can see... when this decides to actually get away... here it's getting a little bit dusty and dirty, so let's put in just a bin to tell the janitors that's what they need to clean. Ooh, nice tree. Oh, hold on, someone's gone. Okay, he's not, uh, you're a nerd and you're not happy with lack of sports. Okay, that shows how well the intelligence of this game is. So, they want some sports in, so let's get that sorted. So that's all on here. Let's put in the gym.
mainly because that's the only one I can put in. That'll do. Okay, they've got a gym, they need a teacher, or a coach, or... Well, yeah, they call it a coach now. Okay, not too fun, not too strict, bit of a skill there. Uh, I'll hire that one. And a bit of a pathway in. Okay, we've now got 17 students there. Athletics is an F that should rise in a bit. One thing I realise I haven't got is a nurse's office. So let's put that in. Yeah, that can go there. Ooh, sounded sore, that. Uh, okay. Now we've got 27 students in. Someone else has just left. Possibly because there's not enough sports there, which I've just sorted out. And here we see the athletics has gone up to D, so that'll that should keep rising for a little bit. And okay, I was just about up in the cafe there to help, just so people had, just so the students have somewhere else to eat. But don't quite have enough there. What I will do is put in, maybe not. So I was about up in the bathroom, but I need a cafe in first before I can do that. Okay, let's put in another classroom. Yeah, social studies, that'll do. Okay, social studies can go there. Another class means another teacher. Yeah, that'll do. My god, it's Professor Frink! Okay, so I've put Professor Frink in. There's someone else who's gone, so I'll just put some... pathway in. And let's see... what he's complaining about. Not enough bathrooms. Uh, I'd sort out in a moment. Okay, here we go. So there's now enough money to get... A cafe and not much else. So let's put that one in. There. There we go, that's unlocked the bathroom there now. One thing I will... Something else I'll need now I've got the cafe in is just some catering stuff. So let's sort that out. Yeah, I'll go for that one. Bye. I hope that's not the sound that people make once they've had something from there. Anyway, that's enough for me. I'll leave that there. And I hope you'll, and I hope you'll catch me up for the, on the next one there. See ya!